just one question suppose there is a 23 year old girl who was treated with oral diclofenac for synovitis or she developed anaphylactic shock due to diclofenac diclofenac is normally not known to cause anaphylaxis but as such in the air condition anything can happen maybe this in this girl diclofenac caused anaphylaxis there was no past history of allergy and the the girl died maybe or he suffered severe harm. What will be the answer? Medical malocurrence, medical negligence, recipsa locator or contributory negligence. First of all, tell me one thing. Could it be, it have been, was it possible to prevent? Was it possible to prevent this anaphylactic shock? Some Students will think, yes, why not? One should have taken the proper medical history. But I have written that there was no past history of allergy. Some will say that some sensitivity testing would have been done. But see, this is an oral drug. You will not do a sensitivity testing for oral drug. Moreover, diclofenac is not normally known to cause anaphylaxis. So, see, medical science is a practical science. Okay, here you have to see what is practically possible. This is a situation which was never expected, which occurred, which it is a kind of misadventure. Here, no one was at fault. Neither the doctor, nor the attendant, nor the nursing staff, nobody was uh, at fault. It is just a misadventure. So, here, this is called medical malocurrence. When no one is at fault. Okay. So, therapeutic misadventure or medical occurrence is when just a medical misadventure where no one is at fault could not have been prevented.